What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We're doing my first ever Super Six Sack unboxing with Six Cents today. Pretty excited to get this. I've been with them for a long time but never gotten one of the Super Six Sacks. And if you guys want to get one for yourself after uh, watching this video, my discount code for the Super Six Sacks is Luna Super Six. Luna Super Six is going to save you 10 bucks off of your first Six Cents Sack. So let's get into it, let's open this thing up. I got it yesterday, haven't opened it up, no idea what's inside, let's check it out. Okay, so off camera I did open up the box just to cut it open so we didn't have to do it on video right here. So we're gonna take it out. What we got is one of these nice six cents bags right here. This is the little like velvety bags that a lot of their stuff comes in, super six sack. It comes in a six cents sack. I hope you guys are getting that. But uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna open this thing up right now and check out all the goodies inside. And it's like Christmas right now. It's like Christmas for sure. Oh, and we did real good right here. We have the Six Cents Axis 2.0 in Shad Scales color. That's a fire color right there. That's legit. I caught one of my biggest fish of all last year on Shad Scales. Not necessarily on the Axis, but on a Shad Scales crankbait of the Cloud9 C15. In that color, it's gonna do some damage, I'm sure of it. And if you guys haven't checked out these axes, you really need to. Don't expect it to fish exactly like a regular square bill crankbait, cause it's not, they are different. Uh, I think a lot of people get this thinking it's gonna be a chatterbait or thinking it's gonna be a square bill. It's in a league of its own. It has a really crazy erratic action. Um, it's gonna be, it's almost like it's deflecting all the time as it's just swimming through the water, but really cool bait. I haven't got to fish this as much as I would like, but it is a cool bait. I have caught fish on it, so I know that you guys can too. But that's number one in the sack is the Shad Scales Colored Six Sense Axis 2.0. All right, so we're gonna go back into the sack again and check out the next set of baits in here. Next set of baits are the Divine Swim Bait, and what size is this? 3.8 Sexified Shad, another great color. Um, the smallmouth around here really like chartreuse. They like that chartreuse sexy shad kind of color with that little bit of blue. This will definitely do some damage. Put it on a jig head, swim it around. You could use it as a spinnerbait trailer. You could use that as a chatterbait trailer, but really good color, chartreuse in there. Um, does really, really good out the desert lakes around here. So another awesome bait from Sixth Sense, another fishy one too. Okay, so bait number three out of the Six Sense sack. Let's see what we got here. And we have the Movement L7. Let me get it out of the wrapping, so hopefully you guys can see it a little bit better. Six Sense Movement L7. This is gonna be diving three to six feet, and these things have crazy, crazy action on them. Uh, five eighth ounce in the Threadfin Shad color, another great Six Sense color. If you have shad in your lakes and you don't have a Threadfin Shad color bait, you need to get some because this color mimics shad perfectly. Um, I use them in some of the bigger C25s, the C20s, and obviously in the movement, it's gonna do the job too. If those fish are up shallow, they're eating shad up shallow, this is a great bait to have. And there's just times where they want this movement. They want that crazy action. Now this thing has some crazy action in it. So if you get one of these, just know that it's got a lot of action, which can be a good thing. And there's just times where they're gonna eat this thing. I've had a day out at Lake Mead where I smashed them on one of these movement baits. Okay, so we're going back into the sack again and we have green pumpkin prawns. Guys, green pumpkin is a staple color that I think everybody that's watching this video should have in their tackle box. You cannot go wrong. If you have stained water, clear water, even a little bit dingy water, green pumpkin's still gonna get bit. And the prawn is a beaver style bait. This thing is great. By itself, I've caught fish Carolina rigging this thing by itself. You could flip this bait, you can put it on as a jig trailer. I've used it as a tratter bait trailer, which then probably means you could also use it as a uh, swim jig trailer. Anything that's trying to mimic a crawdad or a bluegill, you can use some of these six cents prawns for. We've got some more baits in here, so don't you guys worry. We have bait number six coming out right now, and we've got the Crush 75X in Ghost Pro Shad. Another awesome shad color. Cannot go wrong with a color like this. The shad are a lot of times what those fish live, or live around, meaning they wanna eat it, they wanna be around it, they wanna find it, they wanna eat it, they wanna eat it. They wanna eat shad colors, so make sure to get shad colors in your arsenal. This is great in those situations where they 
are a little bit more finicky. They don't want something with quite as much movement as the Movement L7 or a Crush 50X or a 100X. This is a great one for early pre-spawn fishing, but I know that if they eat it then, they'll probably still eat it here in the summertime and into the fall. So we still got some more stuff in here, guys. We're not done yet. We got ourselves a pack of jugular hybrid hooks right here. These things are sharp. I've used some of the Sixth Sense hooks in the past. I only use pretty much six cents and owner hooks. Those are basically the only two that I use in my boat are six cents and owner. Both of them are great. And when you get a subscription pack like this and you get hooks at this quality, you're not gonna be complaining. So another great find in today's super six sack. Okay, so I think we still got two more baits in here. If this wasn't already enough, we still got two more to grab in. It's like it's like a stocking. It's like a stocking stuffer, Christmas day stocking stuffer. Um, you, you're not gonna be complaining with this sack. So we have a movement 80 wake bait right here in the blue 4K bluegill color. This bait is pretty rad. These things are gonna be up on top of the water, you're gonna be waking it right across the top. If those fish are eating top water, or if they don't wanna commit all the way up, sometimes if you reel this fast enough, you're gonna get it underneath the surface a little bit. Another great bait, great in the early morning, great when the sun's going down, just smash some fish on top water. The other day, out at one of my local lakes, and I'm sure that if I was waking this thing across the top of the water, they would've came up and eaten it. Eaten it too, great in those low light situations and uh, especially in clear water too. Uh, those wake baits are gonna be really, really good in that, in that clear water. So last, but certainly not least, I don't know what it is, I haven't peeked, guys. We have, oh man, this is one of my favorite colors right here. Crush 50S, so it's silent in green pumpkin gill. The Crush 50X and the Crush 50 size crankbaits, silent or the X, which has the rattle in it, are my go-to square bill crankbaits. Um, I use the 50s a lot more than I use the 100s. Earlier on in the year when I was traveling around, I caught a lot of fish on square bills. I've caught a lot of fish in the lower Colorado River on square bills. I've been catching fish here at home on square bills as well. This is gonna be a great bluegill color, especially in those stained water situations. I can think of a couple lakes around here that have some stained water in it, or at least one for sure that have stained water in it where I think this could definitely be a player, especially if they're eating shad, eating bluegill, and it's that dirty water. Um, sometimes the rattle could be good, but I think sometimes you gotta switch it up. If everybody else is throwing rattles, maybe you wanna go with something silent, and this Crush 50S in that, uh, what's it called again? Green pumpkin gill. It's got a nice chartreuse color to it, and it's got some of that green pumpkin up on top. Great, great color. Well guys, that was an epic first six cents super six sack that i just got remember use my code luna super six to get ten dollars off of your first super six sack from six cents it's going to get you it's going to save you that 10 bucks off the first sack this is a subscription sack so you're going to get different stuff sent to you each month after you sign up um, if you've had other um, subscription tackle stuff before i've never done it um, I haven't heard good things, but I hear a ton of great things about these Six Sense sacks. They have different ones for you to choose from. Go to their website, go check them out, uh, sixcentsfishing.com. They have tailored sacks, they have different levels, different ones, so go check out. Pick the one that you think is gonna suit you the best and use my code LUNASUPER6. It's gonna save you 10 bucks off of that first sack and then it also lets them know that um, you're supporting my content Please use that code if you watch this video and you go over there to get one of the sacks. But I'm not gonna lie guys, for my first one, this was pretty rad and I'm gonna be looking forward to this every single month. And we're probably gonna do an unboxing video like this every single month when the new sacks come around. Uh, maybe we'll do some six cents sack challenges in the future. But hope you guys enjoyed watching this, giving you a little bit of insight into what the six cents super six sacks are all about and don't forget to use that discount code anything else that's not the subscription sacks with the six fishing.com website use code luna 10 it's going to save you 10 percent off of your order that goes for everything except for the super six sacks that's the one you need to use the luna super six code it'll save you money off of those so go check it out six fishing.com hope you guys enjoyed if you like this and looking forward to more make sure to hit that like button subscribe to the channel share it out with your friends leave some comments let me know what you guys think about the tackle i just got in today's unboxing see you guys